Hey y'all, welcome back to Yellow Texas. All right, so when you live here, you're pretty used to the hot weather, right? Us Texans, we love to get outside and even on the warmest days, I'd much rather be doing something outdoors than just hanging around the house. So how do you beat the heat? Well, our next destination is offering a unique way to stay cool and have a ton of fun while doing it. So grab your bathing suits, y'all, because we're on our way to Houston to experience the super fun and super cool Altitude H2O. So today we are here at Wake Nation Houston, and let me just tell you, if you've been here before, you're gonna love it even more because right behind me is the brand new Altitude H2O to ensure that you, your kids, me, and just about everyone is guaranteed to have an absolute blast. So let's jump right in. Ever wanted to run on water? Well, now you can. Recently opening in Houston, Altitude H2O is considered the largest floating water park in all of Texas, offering 25,000 square feet of family fun, complete with challenging inflatable obstacles and even a trampoline. But before we actually dove in and got onto the water, we wanted to learn a little bit more about this attraction, so we met up with Kenneth, the operations lead. Kenneth, thank you so much for letting us come out here. This place is pretty cool. Uh, so what do you think is so unique about it? How big is this water park? So Altitude H2O is something that there's just nothing like it really in Texas. It's about a half mile course. Uh, kids come out, race on it, run on it, do all the obstacles. It's really a challenge and everyone just has a great time at the end of the day. Yeah, it looks like a ton of fun. And I know you are in partnership with Wake Nation Houston. Uh, so why did y'all choose them to bring this out here? Um, so Wake Nation's a great location to have us out here because a lot of families love to come ride. They have beginner sessions on the weekends. Yeah. Everything is very family friendly and just having the park here gives them something to do when they're tired out from wakeboarding <laughs> or when they finish over here. Everybody likes to go take a few laps at the end of the day. Yeah. And it's just a great way to get your family out and beat the Texas Seat. I do have to ask because I know that there's altitude trampoline park so how did this floating water theme park come to mind? So really the philosophy with altitude is getting kids out and getting them active and everything. Uh, these days it's so easy to sit behind a screen and play video games. Um, you know this is something where kids can come outside, stay active, you know get in the water and do something different. You know there are a lot of trampoline parks out there but not any, many of them are on the water. Right. And like we said with this Texas heat, the best thing, the best way to beat it, jump in the water, go cool off, and just have a great time. All right, so I'm gonna put you on the spot here. Have you actually gone through the obstacle course without falling in? How difficult is it? I actually have. It took a few tries at first, took a couple of wipeouts on the hurdles <laughs> and stuff. Sometimes here and there you get a little slip. But honestly, once you get out here, you learn this thing like the back of your hand. It's like riding a bike. You just can't, you can't get off of it, honestly. It's the best part. Perfect, let's jump in. All right, let's do it. Yeah. Attention, altitude jumpers for the 12 o'clock group. Let's make our way down to the water and get ready to go. So here's how it all goes down. Step one, gear up. Make sure it's nice and snug. Step two, rules. All right, guys, rule number one out here. We're all gonna follow this one today. Have fun. If you need a hand, Ask any of our guards or splash monitors out there. They will help you up. Everything's feet first into the water, so flips are awesome. We love watching them. See what y'all got. That's about all we got. I'm gonna let y'all go have fun for 45 minutes. We ready? Yeah. Let's do it, guys. Ready? Step three, swim to the start and let the games begin. like child's play from afar, and it is a ton of fun, but some of these obstacles are way harder than they look. I'd say this isn't just a water park, it's more like a workout. But the good news is anytime you need a break, it's easy to cool off with a relaxing dip. Sometimes you cool off unintentionally.
All right, I'd say pretty great day all the way around. And it was a great workout with a ton of fun in the water. So if you are in the Houston area, make sure to check out Wake Nation. And if you want to make the kids happy, Altitude H2O will leave them pretty thrilled. I'm going to jump in one last time. We'll see y'all later. Need to check out this enormous floating playground for yourself? Click on altitudeh2o.com for more information.